Time now for our children's story. We have two kids that are here. No, three. 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 Yeah. What we like to do is ask them to go around and collect the children's offering. So uh, if you guys would like to hold out those green flags, let the children see it. Collect the flags and put them right here. Collect the dollars. Julie yelled, 
I'll never forgive you. I won't, I won't. And I don't want to be your friend anymore. And I don't ever want to play with you again. Now they were sisters and they were best friends. So listen. How do you feel when someone hurts you badly? Usually you feel so bad that you just wish you could hurt them back. Uh, or you want to get even with them. God has provided a way for us to heal the hurts between us. The Bible teaches us that Christians live in relationship with one another. Human beings will hurt each other because of their sinfulness, but the Bible teaches us to say that we are sorry. How easy is that to do? Is it easy to say you're sorry? Not really. Listen, every adult in here can attest to the same thing. When we do something wrong, when we hurt people, it's not easy for us to say we're sorry. But God made a way through His Son, Jesus Christ, to allow that to happen. That Jesus gives us the strength to, number one, see that what we did was wrong. And two, to be able to say that we're sorry and not do it again. So, the two sisters had to decide how they were going to treat each other after that. So, Janet, who threw the doll out the window, thought, you know what I'll do? I'm really sorry. I'll give her my doll. Julie was so mad that she thought that she was going to sneak into Janet's room, take her doll, and rip her hair out. <laughs> But she thought about it, and she realized that's really not what Jesus would want me to do. And she still was hurting, and she didn't know how to deal with this anger inside of her. And she talked to her mother, and she cried, and her mother said, listen, what God wants us to do is forgive. Can you forgive your sister? And she goes, no, I can't. I can never forgive her. And then her mother asked her, have you ever done anything wrong? Have you ever done anything wrong to me? Have you lied to me? She goes, yes. She goes, have I forgiven you? She goes, yes, mommy, I'm glad you did. She goes, as I forgive you, because Jesus forgives me, you need to forgive your sister. She thought about it, and she said, she's right, baby. I do need to forgive my sister. And the sister was coming out of the room with her doll at this time to give it to her sister because of what she did. And when they saw each other, she said, I want to give you my doll because I ruined yours. And I'm so sorry. I hope you can forgive me. And I hope you'll want to play with me again. And they both looked at each other and they both cried. And you know what they did after that? They hugged each other. And they gave each other. And they, I wish I could tell you they lived happily ever after. But what they learned is that God is real. Jesus gives you the power to forgive. And that when we hurt people, we need to apologize. We say, I'm we're sorry, and we need to try to make things right. Okay? Yeah. Hey, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, go back to your seats.